I'm Thomas Tedder. I'm the founder of Alien Gear Holsters. I began making holsters in 2010, so it's been about a 10 year journey to get where we are now. I began carrying a gun to protect my family. That was my primary motivation. One day I was at Chuck E. Cheese with my kids and uh, one of them took off running across the parking lot. And so naturally I went running after and then my gun fell out. I was wearing one of these cheap nylon holsters and uh, it slid across the parking lot, scuffed up my gun. A lot of people saw that. Actually, it was, a, it was quite an embarrassing moment for me. So I knew that I needed a better holster. I mean, all the time I had been rearranging, trying to get this thing to stay stable. And uh, it finally culminated in that moment where my gun fell out and went sliding across a parking lot. And so I knew that uh, that was an irresponsible moment for me as a gun owner and uh, people were staring. Uh, I had to pick up the gun and reholster it. I, um, I knew that I had to do better as a gun owner and a concealed carrier. Uh, this desk right here is something I started the company on. I was driving down the road and I saw this upside down on the side of the road. It had been discarded. So I pushed it into the back of my Forerunner and brought it home. Uh, I would actually make holsters with a buck knife and uh, very rudimentary tools right here on this desk. So it was, uh, it was a, a very humble experience where it was just grassroots, me making holsters for local people right there in my house. After a while, um, my wife wouldn't go for that anymore. And so I moved out to the shed. I kind of rehabbed the shed a little bit. It was, it was really leaned over like this. It was a very old building. And, uh, I actually pulled it with a come along and got it most of the way straight and rebuilt some of the walls and I was making holsters in there for about another year and a half until it just the operation wouldn't fit in there anymore. Customers really like what we've made and what we've designed and the price points that we can come in at when it's a higher quality product and it's a more affordable price. It's a very easy choice for our customers to make. So it's easy for us to think of concealed carry the way it is today. But 10 years ago, it wasn't quite the same. It was a newer concept and not nearly as many people were concealed carrying. Um, also, there were far less choices on the market. So at the time in the hybrid holster market, there were really just a few competitors and they were primarily priced around $90, $70, maybe for one of the cheaper ones. So I knew what it cost to make these holsters. I knew that that price was outrageous and it would be far uh, cheaper for me to make. I mean to sell these I could sell them for far cheaper and have a better product So at the time the competitors I knew what leather they were using and the price they paid for it I rejected that product. I thought it was inferior. I bought better leather. I bought whole cowhides of uh, English bridal leather that was quite thick supple instead of more like a double shoulder out of Mexico is what a lot of the competition was using uh, they were using 060 Kydex. I was using 090 Kydex, which was 30 or 50% thicker. It was uh, harder to work with, but once I figured out the processes, what we had was a better holster. So we had better leather, we had better plastic, we had better features. It's, I mean, it just shook the whole holster world. It really, it really did its job on its own. I didn't have to do much marketing. This thing just took off. People loved it. They loved the price point. They loved the quality and the features they were getting. And that was a springboard that allowed us to build a company um, where we could innovate with things that we never could from working out of the shed. So people ask me all the time, why Alien Gear Holsters? Why the name Alien? Um, that's kind of what separates us from others is the technological advancement that you see on our holsters, the better quality. We're, we're really light. We, say, we like to say light years ahead of our competition. We really believe that. And as far ahead as we are right now, we are still working on cool new stuff that we can't wait to show you guys as we're coming out with these things. So I would like to thank each and every one of you for supporting Alien Gear Holsters because you're not just supporting me or some nameless person or company. You're actually supporting 300 Americans working in America to design and build and ship you great products. So thank you very much. Thank <laughs> you.